Hello, you're watching the news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Ajawi. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa ratified and issued a series of laws following the endorsement of the Council of Representatives and the Shura Council. They include Law 12 of 2020 to amend Article 3 of the Decree Law 10 of 1976 on housing, Law 13 of 2020 to amend certain regulations that govern the real estate sector as per Law 27 of 2014. Law 14 of the year 2020 to amend certain regulations that govern the Central Bank of Bahrain as per Law of 64 of 2006. Law 15 of 2020 to amend Article 3 of Law 2 of 1994 on urban planning and Law 16 of 2020 to amend certain regulations that govern the Bahrain Chamber of Commerce and Industry as per Law 48 of the year 2012. Upon the directives of the Executive Committee, chaired by His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the Labour and Social Development Minister, Jamil bin Mohammed Al Hamidan, has issued an, an administrative circular reinstating activities, programs and individual rehabilitation sessions at private centres, accommodating people with disabilities from June 14th. The decision also took into account the recommendation of the National Task Force for Combating COVID-19, chaired by the Supreme Council for Health, Lieutenant General Dr. Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdullah Al Khalifa. Hamidan stressed compliance with the mandatory precautionary measures to ensure the safety and health of students and employees at the center. The minister underlined the government's drive to provide social and health protection for people with physical disabilities, commending the efforts and dedication of Bahrainis running the privately owned rehabilitation centers and the advanced level of services which enable the affiliates to be integrated in the development march, formal educational and training institutions. The lower criminal court fined today three individuals, each 1,000 dinars, for violating preemptive health procedures to combat the COVID-19 virus and prevent its spread. The court also fined another defendant for BD-1000 for breaking health regulations for commercial outlets. The court also fined two defendants, 3,000 BD and 1,000 BD respectively, for violating a ministerial decision on closing commercial outlets. The High Court of Appeal rejected the appeals of two defendants accused of violating the home quarantine. The public prosecution launched an investigation into the notifications from the Public Health Directorate against 23 defendants who violated health regulations to combat coronavirus and curtail its spread. It questioned them and released them on bail pending investigation. The Ministry of Health said today that the number of active coronavirus cases has reached 5,330 with 11,903 recoveries and 36 registered deaths. 137 people are receiving treatment. The Ministry of Health urges everyone to adhere to the rules and affirm the importance of following instructions, such as washing one's hand with soap on a regular basis, along with avoiding shaking hands and close contact. Moreover, covering the nose and the mouth when sneezing and avoiding public spaces when possible.